Good morning, my llama mamas, and anyone else who is on YouTube. This is Jacob Llama Do Vlogs, and welcome to my channel. I will be reviewing this Lego Bionicles Star Lego Star Wars Bionicles um, Imperial Death Trooper set number seven five one two one. It's eight to fourteen, and it has one hundred and six pieces. This guy is really cool. I actually was asking for this guy. He's really cool like i have a couple of them as you can see my background if you see right here i got cody back there i've got chewbacca and k2so there's back and i love these guys they're cool i have also down here have general grievous and darth vader and luke skywalker i'm pretty sure yeah luke skywalker anyways let's get on with this thing all right this one i will be building in a oh oh, oh okay Already built. Oh. Like, I guess we can get rid of this box then and I'll be right back. Sorry, guys, just some a little malfunction. No, he did not come built. I already built him. I don't think I'm gonna do any of these building videos. That will take a long time, and I don't like like 20 minute long videos of recording stuff. I like to keep it kind of short, and that would waste a lot of memory in my phone, but. Anyways, here is our Death Trooper figure. I know, he's a little small. He's actually pretty tall compared to, like, Cody. If I bring Cody in here, he's tall. Like, an entire head tall, so... I don't know. Um, he, he's not as tall as Chewbacca, though. But, anyways, since... Stop listening to me talking. So, let's start with the head. I just gotta pop it off. So he's got a lot of detailing in his head, a lot of detailing, and if we can get this to focus. So he's got these dark green lenses, but he's also got this bright green, kind of like glowing thing. Like in the movie, it lights up, and his eyes are dark green. People think it's black, but it's actually dark green. It was, con it was confirmed by the director of Rogue One, I can't remember his name right now, but... Here on the side, he's got his little, like, focus thing. I don't know what they're called. And coming around to the back, he's got these little ventilation system type deal things over here. And on this side, it's kind of just blank. And his is kind of, like, more face forward, which I think is really cool. These guys are cool. I like these guys. They're much cooler than Stormtroopers because they can aim. Ha! Ah. Anyways... So now let's get on with the, everything else. Starting off with his gun. He's got this rifle gun. And when it cam comes with blasters. But usually when you press this thing. It would launch the blaster out of there. You can see it's got the blaster hole. This is an arm armrest piece. And his hand would stick on this little four-sided red um, attachment piece. And he also comes with a little mini gun. It's really cool. It's just, I don't know, a mini gun. You would shoot the blaster out of there. That's like a focus deal right there. And that just attaches with this little piece right here. You just attach it on the side of his leg. Alright. Now let's get on with the rest of the figure. So going up his legs, he's just got plain black legs until, you know, you reach... The top of the leg, and it's got the little blaster. But on the other side, it doesn't have a blaster. So now, if we take a look at his torso piece, which is gonna pop off, um, it's got a lot of detailing. No, he's got even got crotch detailing. <laughs> Sounds so weird, but he's got crotch detailing. He's got this little like gap type deal thing. He's got this belt. You can see the silver belt buckle. He's got this little loop thing. They would attach his armor. And he's got a bunch of this line texture type detail thing. Like all over his suit. And then he's got this line detailing right there. He's got two buckles on the side. And he's got this gray line that goes down on the top of his torso. So yeah, that's all for his torso. So now we can take another better look at him. Um, on his arms, they're, it's plain black. Except for this, on this side, it's got 
this little line and a couple scratches on his little, like, shoulder, um, tech. He's got this little claw thing, which I don't know why. He never used a claw in the movie. You guys can tell me, like, is it like his comm link or something? Because, I mean, I, w I don't know. It, it looks cool, though. Then he's got this little hanging piece, which attaches these little buckle things that are full of probably bullets. And it also hangs over his shoulder. It just folds over his shoulder. It's like a little shoulder cape. And, I mean, yeah, I guess that's it for the minifigure, so, give you one last look at the Death Trooper. He's got no back printing, sadly enough, but, I mean, it's fine. Get, we get enough back printing with other characters, but, yeah, that's it for, that's it for right now, guys, and I will see you next time. Peace out.